So today's project is a John Deere 2955 clutch. And so here, I mean, you can maybe see it on the camera. It's got a lot of wear. I'd say it's about 30 thousands worn down. And on the flywheel grinder, it would just take forever. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the lathe with a boring bit and take most material off and then also take down this step because it's an 850 step and so the lathe is just a whole lot faster than the grinder. So I'm going to set this at a low speed. This thing goes fast. When it's this big, uh, what is the size? It should be about uh, 14 inches wide. So slow RPMs. I'll set it at a nice cool 105 RPM. Now, something different. I want my feed to work its way out. Normally on a lathe, your power feed goes in. So what I'm actually gonna do, I'm gonna switch that. Easy enough. I'm gonna set my, right over here. See, I've got tool six. Select tool number six and zero it out. We got a really gr deep groove right there. So I'm just going to do a fast hand feed across the whole thing. So when you do this, it really shows the hot spots. Right here, it got really hot. You can see how dark that metal is. Now the lathe doesn't like cutting that, and that's why a grinder's a good option. But we're taking off a lot of material. There's so we'll, we'll take another 10,000 to pass. We'll speed it up.
that's pretty good. A little bit missed there, but we'll get that with the grinder. But, but yeah, you can really see the heat spots. And lathe just won't cut that. I think it cuts it, but not nice. But as you do that, you're essentially been putting a thread in here, so that's why we're grinding it. And it looks shiny. And on to the next part. So now we've got to check our depth. So the pressure plate sits in here, but it sits on top of this. This is called a step. So this is a step flywheel. So on there it reads uh, 880 thousandths. So that means on the step I'm going to have to take off 30 thousandths. So now I'm measuring the step to um, 
see how much I need to grind off of the steps to make it fit that 850. And it's showing that I need to cut 13 thousandths off. So I'm going to do that with the grinder and that'll give it a nice uniform even surface. There I go. Nailed it on the first try right at 850. Dang, I'm good. Well, there you go. Flywheel's ready to go back on the tractor. Thanks for watching.